Hello, your Royal Majesty, and welcome now to Wednesday. So good to see you again. Sunny and chatty today for the Leos. The moon is off of Saturn, thank goddess, and it's now just in Libra. So this is a chatty day. It's a day where you have conversations, get things off your chest, blog, journal, talk to your therapist. It's really time to communicate and exchange information as it's related to your feelings. So talk to your best friend forever. Talk to that person you've been waiting to talk to. Zimmon in the sun. We're in chapter two of sun in Pisces. And today, Jupiter is ruling the day, plus the sun's conjuncting Jupiter. Now, when Jupiter rules the day, it means it's time to think outside your box. What Leos are trying to get to ultimately is how to open up and surrender. That's what this, really, this trans is about in the eighth house. How to surrender, how to open up. Now, that comes down to certain trust issues, and that comes down to certain boundaries. So I ask you today, think outside your box. You may think that you have to date a guy for 20 weeks before you can surrender to them. Maybe not. Maybe what you're waiting over 20 weeks is to find out a few certain, certain things about that person. So maybe if you, in the first five dates, ask those questions, well, then maybe you could open up to that person in just three weeks. Not that it's a race. The point is, is there's other ways to open up. There's other ways to surrender. There's other ways to come into places of trust. What does it take for you to surrender? Try moving your boundaries around a little bit today and being more open to some things, more closed down to others. See how that feels. Jupiter is about adventure. In fact, I have a question to ask you today. That is related to Venus conjuncting Uranus. Venus is creation vibration. Uranus is innovation. We will have creative innovation today when it comes to chapter three of trust. So the universe is helping you see the big picture. And this is my question. What in this lifetime do you intend to inherit from the earth? What do you intend to inherit? Do you intend to inherit to be the, to the title of the greatest actress on the planet? Do you intend to inherit the greatest intimacy ever known? Do you intend to inherit the greatest wealth ever had? Or is it to, to something simple and modest? What do you intend to receive from the planet? What is the biggest thing you intend to receive? Okay. That said, what can you do today to prepare for that? How can you be adventurous and different today to prepare for that? I think that's what Venus and Uranus is trying to tell us. And today, speaking to us, Skip Jennings, our urban mystic, our motivational minister here at Soul Garden, has got a second chapter of Sun and Pisces going live today. He is amazing on camera, folks. You've got to see him this month. He's live everywhere, Soul Garden streams. And tonight, DJ Leo David Palmer live with Astro Mingle, our sexy show where we have guys and signs and girls and signs all interrelating. Live chat, live music. David answers your question on camera. I'll probably make a cameo appearance. It's live tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. SoulGarden.tv. Click on Astro Mingle. All right, Your Royal Majesty, that wraps up Hump Day, but I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. Soul Garden.